In this video we are going to talk about 10 dangerous pets people own. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Exotic animal assaults are highly sensationalized, and they are frequently publicized shortly after they occur. Stories about crazy people who buy alternative animals never cease to amaze and elicit strong emotions in people. Despite the rarity of these occurrences, opponents of the exotic pet trade frequently bring up the same handful of mad exotic pet ownership gone wrong stories. It should be known that, based on objective statistics, exotic animal attacks are very rare. When all exotic animal species are combined, they happen about 10 times a year. Dogs, on the other hand, kill roughly 30 people every year and bite or harm an untold number of others. Most pet species do not regard general bites as newsworthy. Consider that a large percentage of canines are far too small to cause serious harm to humans. Apparently, more people and their pets are getting into dog fights, which is a bad thing. Number 10. Crocodile Monitor. General herp aficionados occasionally purchase incredibly huge and predatory reptiles, which is a major problem because these lizards are nothing like owning a bearded dragon. In captivity, this enormous monitor grows to be 8 to 12 feet tall, necessitating vast enclosures that most private keepers can't or won't provide, you will often see large reptiles inappropriately kept in smaller cages than recommended. Bite injuries are always a risk with these normally high-strung animals, and their sharp teeth and strong jaws can even cut off fingers and cause severe tissue damage even in young animals. A monitor's saliva has a lot of bacteria in it, which can cause a lot of bad things to happen, like shivering. This is a report from a hobbyist who had his monitor bite him. Number 9. Alligators. Is it possible to have an alligator as a pet? That thing is going to eat you. That's not entirely true. Alligator assaults are extremely rare, and all of the deaths that have occurred have been caused by wild animals. The explanation is obvious, being surprised by a wild camouflaged alligator is significantly more difficult than being surprised by one in a clear tiny pool in captivity. In addition, alligators do not pursue humans. Alligators may attack in self-defense, but they rarely see humans as prey. As a result, the thought that they will break into your home and eat your children should be banished from your thoughts. Number 8. Old World Monkeys. All large monkeys have canines that can cause major injury, even if they are removed, the remaining teeth are still deadly, and it doesn't help that monkey are prone to hazardous, unexpected outbursts when they reach sexual maturity, which might surprise inexperienced monkey owners. The best monkey for a pet is thought to be the black-capped capuchin monkey, which is the species used by the organization Helping Hands, with their teeth removed, which trains primates to help people who are less fortunate. The physical severity of a monkey's harm is obviously proportional to its size, with small marmosets incapable of inflicting massive wounds. However, I've highlighted old-world monkeys because they carry the majority of non-human primate zoonotic diseases that pose a health risk to people. Number 7. Large Constrictor Snakes. The threat posed by snakes is frequently grossly exaggerated. Surprisingly, despite their widespread popularity, Burmese, reticulated, African rock python, anaconda, and boa constrictors, all large snakes in the United States kill only one human, or less, every year. Number 6. Wolf Dogs. It may come as a surprise to some that wolf dogs, when kept as pets in our society, are potentially more deadly than wolves. Wolf dogs, on the other hand, are more likely to be free and not afraid of humans than fully wild animals are. Wolves, like lions, are natural pack animals who thrive when given lower-ranking roles in the hierarchy. This also reduces the likelihood of biting. Adding domesticated dog behavior to the mix can result in a more unpredictable animal, but because genetics differ, so do the creatures produced. As a result, not all wolf dogs will exhibit troublesome behaviors, the problem is that we don't know which ones will. Furthermore, wolf dog owners are more prone than big cat owners to raising their pets in a less restrictive manner, which may account for the few incidents in which wolf dogs have attacked people. 
The difficulty with wolf dog attack statistics is that they are difficult to distinguish from very wolfy looking canines for most people, and sometimes breeders lie, so pure dogs may have been inadvertently included in the list of attackers. Attacks should be rare as long as wolves and wolf dogs are kept by responsible owners who can provide them with the large, secure enclosure and time consuming training that is required in their care. Number 5. Elephants. Elephants are plainly enormous enough to damage people by accident, even when they are not aggressive, which is why only professionals should deal with them. When a large animal like an elephant gets scared, it can damage or kill anyone within close range, just like horses. Despite their vegetarian lifestyle, elephants have minds of their own, and there have been instances of them killing their trainers or owners on purpose. As a result, AZA zoological institutions now require elephants and trainers to interact in a safe manner. Traditional handling practices, such as the use of a bullhook, are still used by circuses. Outside of circus employees and other exhibitionists, elephants are rarely kept privately. There have been no recent fatalities on the few occasions when they have been maintained as private pets. Number 4. Venomous Snakes. One bite from a front-fanged venomous snake, commonly known as a hot, will send the victim to the hospital indiscriminately. Because venomous, not poisonous, snakes demand skilled handlers, who have mentored professionals or other long-term owners of hot snakes, they are, understandably, extremely dangerous. Number 3. Big Cats. People can, and have, been devoured by big cats. Smaller exotic cats, on the other hand, are frequently accused of the same propensity, despite the fact that their wild cousins only devour tiny creatures like rabbits. When big cats, lions, tigers, mountain lions, jaguars, leopards, and not cheetahs, attack or fatally maul their caregivers, they undoubtedly provide the most interesting news stories, and the news media never misses a beat reporting on them. So, if you can recollect the last time you heard of a huge cat attack, you'll know that they're not very common, happening about twice a year on average. The owner or caretaker is nearly always the victim. Number 2. Bears. Because of their intelligence, dexterity, and omnivorous, opportunistic nature, bears are rated ahead of big cats. Like a huge cat, they have tremendous power and a desire for meat, but they may also be drawn to humans, even breaking into their houses, as both wild and captive individuals have done. In contrast to the frequently secretive giant felines, escaping bears pose a significantly greater threat to the public. Black bears are the most popular bear species kept as pets, and they are also responsible for the majority of deadly assaults on humans, both in the wild and in captivity. However, the scarcity of larger bears kept as private pets, such as polar bears and grizzly bears, may have contributed to the absence of fatal data from them, or it could just be that humans are less eager to enter their cages. Number 1. Chimpanzees. Chimpanzees, despite their incredible strength, have not caused the most fatalities on this list. In fact, there hasn't been a fatality from a captive chimpanzee in recent US history, but their near fatalities, such as the well-known incident involving XTV star Travis the Chimp, are terrifying. Chimpanzees, like elephants, have more complicated cognition, making it difficult or impossible to understand what's going on in their heads and how they'll react to new situations. They have natural hierarchies, just like monkeys, and their behavior can change suddenly, especially if they escape and come across individuals they don't know who are unfamiliar with chimp behavior. This is particularly dangerous for animals that have reached sexual maturity around the age of seven. As a result, chimps are the best qualifiers for a public safety issue in the exotic pet sector. They usually attack by biting off body parts such as noses, fingers, and other body parts, and they like playing with people while refusing to let them leave. While all of the victims were saved, the devastation was significant. What do you think about our video? Please let us know in the comments area below. If you enjoyed this video and would want to hear from me again, please subscribe and turn on the notification before leaving. Thank you for watching us.